ace Indian shooter Manu Bhakar has ended a historic campaign at the Paris Olympics. Now, this is one name. You say it and you have a smile on your face if you're anywhere in India. And, of course, she's brought two medals back home. She won bronze in the women's 10-meter air pistol event and in 10-meter air pistol mixed team event as well. The 22-year-old reflected on her landmark campaign in an exclusive interview with Beyond Sports editor Digvijay Singh Deo in Shatteru. We are going to leave you here with this brilliant, brilliant interview with this brilliant lady. Thank you so much for tuning in. Come right back after this. A memorable campaign at the Paris Olympics has come to an end for Manu Bhakar. Two medals and a fourth place. Your sport is cruel at times. We had you celebrating with us uh, over the last week. But today it's nice to see a smile on your face, despite coming so, so close to achieving that hat-trick. Well, what can I say? As you said, sports can be cruel at times. Uh, but I put in a lot of work, me and my team, my coach, my uh, like the entire team has put in a lot of effort to be able to reach here. And I, um, like the value of the medals, I, I know like, it means the world to me. The medals and the fourth position as well means the world to me. And I'm so grateful that I could uh, achieve for India what I achieved. And uh, I hope I continue to do so in the future as well. Okay, look back on that final because, you know, I love watching 25 meter pistol because everything changes with one series. At the end of one series, you were down in seventh. Then a couple of, you shot a five, you went up to second. It just goes up and down, right? So what were your thoughts during that match? Because were you just concentrating on getting that shot right the moment the light went green? So honestly, I was not looking at the monitor. Uh, I was like, oh, do your thing. Do just, they'll, you know, if, if there's something, they'll take your name. They'll, uh, if even if it's an elimination or the first position or the second position, they will take the name. So you don't do not bother looking at the screen. Uh, so throughout the match, I was like, okay, next series now ready. Next series now ready. So yeah, that. Okay. So your second Olympics has come to an end. I had asked you uh, before you came here. What did your first Olympics teach you? What are you taking back from your second Olympic Games, Manu? Apart from a lot of joy that you've given to an entire country, but for you personally, we tend to at times forget that an athlete also has a personal space. What are you taking back personally? Uh, personally, I'm taking back, um, firstly, yeah, definitely like the two medals that I've got uh, and uh, the experience of the fourth position um, round. So I'm taking back many smiles and lots of love from here. And it was a great experience to be here to, um, this like these entire five, six days. So it has been a great show for me. And I hope that um, I keep working hard. Uh, I really love to like do follow my routine and wake up early and then do everything. So I love to do that and I will continue to do that and keep supporting, keep loving. Uh, so Hang on, we need to, that's important because the support shouldn't just come when you're winning because I remember the entire team coming back from Tokyo. It was more or less a similar team to this young team. So you need the support when the chips are down. Definitely, that that's the most crucial time in any athlete's career, and when it's a matter of time, like when you make it, make the athlete feel like they're not deserving, they're not good enough. That's the time when many many athletes feel like giving up, and that's not a good feeling. I've been there; that's not a good feeling. We need somebody to support us, even in the downfalls, even in the phases of um, not like grand moments. So. Uh, so many shooters performed so great here, like Arjun Babuta, Ramita. So many people in, were in the finals. Swapnil did a great job. He won the bronze. So I think it's a great show for India, but an athlete cannot be like on the top of the peak every time. So it has to be like this also sometimes, then like this, then like this. So we need the support even in the low phases and the high phases, definitely. Uh, so just keep cheering for us and keep loving us.